aftermarket wheels, washer fluid low, run AMS oil, it's not a problem, fuel filter is also good, there you go, service trailer brake system. So I had this problem, um, I bought, this is a, a 2007 and a half LMM, I bought it in 2012 and within just a month or two of uh, purchasing this pickup I had that issue. Um, I'd be driving along, going up a hill, turning left, turning right, whatever. No trailer connected and that uh, diagnostic message would just pop up, service trailer brake system. I did a ton of research on the forums and uh, what I found is, so Chevrolet installed a factory trailer brake control module on these pickups and it works great up until it doesn't. Unfortunately, that's one of the things that uh, Chevy has had an issue with as far as electrical problems on these pickups. And you can replace it for about $150 and then it might break again. Um, so you could do that or you could install an aftermarket trailer brake control module, which I've done right here. This is a uh, Takancha Prodigy P2 and I've had this on here for two years and it has worked great and I've had no issues with it at all. You don't have to uninstall the factory trailer brake control module. It's got nothing to do with that. All you have to do is hook it up to power and hook it up to the uh, brake pedal switch and uh, it works great. Uh, side note here, my father-in-law once installed a $40 trailer brake control module on his pickup and the thing locked up every time he pushed on the brakes even with it turned all the way down. So don't cheap out on the aftermarket trailer brake control modules. Buy a halfway decent one and it should should serve you well.